Oh, ho, ho, look what I have here. I have some beautiful refinished snowflakes. So, surprise of all surprises, these things were, I mean, they look absolutely perfect right now, but they were originally um, you know, typical of a 30 year old wheel. They had uh, some damage to the uh, to the edges, you know, there were a few sections that were crooked on the inside and outside, so we had to re-weld. Um, even on the, the crowns on the edges here, there were some, some chunks taken out. And um, so it's amazing what these wheel guys can do. So uh, the other thing that was sort of a bit of a drag is that the original owner had um, rounded the edges off. He'd, he'd, he'd gone to a completely uh, sort of a matte uh, silver look. He'd sprayed them a silver color, but he'd, he'd rounded the edges off with a Dremel or something and uh, a little bit. So what we did is we took these wheels and we've remachined re the face of them. So we've taken the, some material off the surface. And then if you look at the back, we did the same thing in the back. We've, uh, we've, we've taken material off on the inside and, and refinished the insides as well. Um, so they're, they're gorgeous inside as well as outside. Um, and they're, they're a little bit lighter. I think they're about a pound and a half lighter um, than the originals. The originals are about 15. These are a little less than that. Um, the rubber I've chosen is the uh, Teresa 2s. The, uh, these are um, the Dunlop uh, sort of track tire or street DOT legal street strip tire or street track tire. They've uh, um, really dry performance only is what they recommend them for. I was going to shave them but I decided not to because it'll just impair the wet weather performance even further but um, they should provide ample traction you know I'm going to the original 185 60 14s and a lot of people do 195s or even 205s and uh, on 15 inch rooms or bigger and um, you know I want to keep original and uh, I want these things to, to um, stick like crazy and I think they will because the car is going to be you know lighter than the original car so I think that a combination of really modern high performance uh, rubber like this and a light car should give me uh, you know 0.9 G's or 0.95 G's worth of cornering and I'll measure all this obviously so we'll we'll see how this works but super happy with these guys these are beautiful beautiful wheels and uh, couldn't uh, couldn't be any happier with these.